Hello, thanks for tuning in to today's broadcast. I am your host, Cedric Credit Champion. I am here at Captain D's on Benavista Road. And as always, got another exciting video for you. Today, we're going to count down the top six YouTube influencers. And before we go into it, I want you to go ahead and subscribe to the channel, like the video, share the video with a friend. And look, if you haven't seen the other videos, please, by all means, go to my channel and take a look at the other influencers that are in the top 10. We've already um, established that life of Corey, Corey Pritchett, he came in at number three. Then we had CJ on 32s come in at number four. And Bandman Kevo came in at number five. Now we're gonna do number six today. And coming in at number six from Waynesboro, Georgia, by way of Atlanta, Georgia, is none other than the funny man himself, Country Wayne. That's right, Country Wayne comes in as our number six YouTube influencer and just wanna send a shout out to him. He's doing his thing up in the Atlanta area. Um, look, Country Wayne, what can you say? I mean, if you are on Facebook, you see that he's always on his grind, right? now. Think about it. Before the pandemic took place, Country Wayne, he was doing skits on YouTube or on Facebook primarily, but, you know, he didn't have that same buzz that he has now. It's like he has gone to another level. I mean, you can see it in his videos. You know, they're starting to wear the designer you know, the jewelry, you know, you're starting to see the Maybach, you know, in the videos. And I mean, he has quality actors also, actors and actresses in his video. And so, yeah, he's gone to another level now. And he tells his story about how he did it. You know, he says at the very beginning of the pandemic, you know, um, he was $13,000 in debt. And he, one of his hashtags is Jesus is popping. And he said, well, we're going to have to prove that now because he said, I'm $13,000 in debt. You know, he paid his taxes. He said he had like $100,000, but he paid his taxes. And, um, you know, it emptied out, you know, his account. He, I'm sure he had other costs or whatever. And um, make a long story short, he said he started putting out videos every day. And his channel exploded, right? Look, at the same time that people were losing jobs and losing money and income was sparse, well, guess what? At the same time, he was blowing up. That goes to show you money moves around. If you don't have it, somebody is getting it, right? If you're spending money, somebody's receiving money. And if you're receiving money, somebody's spending money. So I always remember this, that, you know, there's always something that you can do when your money is running out or going low, right? There's always some, but you gotta position yourself. He positioned himself and he turned up a notch on his grind, start putting out videos on the regular. And the next thing you know, he's Country Wayne, multi-millionaire, right? I mean, he's, he's really doing it now. And so that's so very important. If you're gonna do movies or skits or any kind of content that you be on your grind it is like a job you got to treat it like a job if you want to leave your nine to five job you got to treat whatever business or whatever endeavor you're doing like your full-time job you got to give it that kind of effort you got to research you got to find out okay how do you go to the next level then once you find out you got to implement different strategies sometimes when you do one thing it may not work you got to try try again right and so that's what country wayne did and that's why he comes in at number six on our list now what what else can we learn from country wayne you can learn how to do multiple streams of income something i always talk about and teach because you can never have enough money but it goes back to the mindset if you're not a millionaire you don't have enough money but you can have the attitude 
that you're comfortable and that you're satisfied. And that's all right. There's nothing wrong with being comfortable. There's nothing wrong with being satisfied. But if you do want to be rich, if you want to be abundantly supplied, if you have a goal of being a millionaire, making a certain amount of money every month, then I want to let you know it is obtainable, but you have to create multiple streams of income. Now, Country Wayne, he also has a personality. He goes by name Drip. Drip is his rap name, right? And so he connected with producer Zaytoven, and he and Zaytoven collabed, and Drip was able to make his album. Now, Drip also does some acting in the skits. And so look, he's using another personality to make him money. Same person, two different personalities, two different characters, right? And so he also, I've seen him do stand-up comedy, right? So he has multiple streams of income. Everything is still in the niche of comedy, but multiple streams of income. So look, if you have a hair salon, you can sell hair too. In addition to selling hair, you can sell products too. You can have an online website as well. All dealing with hair. See, those are multiple streams of income. You don't have to buy um, inventory that's not in your niche. You can stay right in your niche and have multiple streams of income. Have money coming in from different ways. And that's all I'm saying. Look, I'm right here on Bitter Vista Road. And I can see in the background different businesses, nail shop, hair salon, um, cricket, you know, just different businesses across the street. And, you know, when you're in business for yourself, you have to understand something that if that is your means of making money, then if customers don't come in, you don't get paid. And so that's why marketing and advertising is so important. Look, you have a business, you got to advertise. You got to advertise. That's how people are going to hear about you. The more people hear about you, the more chance and percentage that people are going to come and shop and do business with you. It's like that in anything that you do. So you got to put money back into your business. You can't just live off and spend everything that you make, right? Me, myself, I'm going to begin to do more advertising as far as YouTube goes, as far as my um, credit expertise goes right you know i'm an expert at doing credit i'm working on somebody's credit right now so if you want to have excellent credit all you got to do is direct message me and i will contact you let you know my fee and we can get started on you having excellent credit just like me and look when you get that excellent credit you can get high limit credit cards you can get lines of credit from the bank you know you don't have to worry about money anymore you don't have to go to the payday i remember going to the payday loan you know stores and i would get a loan until payday i don't have to do all that no more right and so look where there's a will there's a way but you gotta take action all right look spend about four hundred dollars and get your credit fixed you know what i'm saying get those negative items removed off your credit get high limit credit cards but it's totally up to you all right well listen this is another episode Set of the Credit Champion, Credit Rich Empire. I thank you for tuning in. Stay tuned in. We're going to get to the number two and even number one YouTube influencer very shortly. So stay locked in. Share this on your Facebook timeline. And remember, like the video. That helps Facebook share this with other people. And remember, I'm representing Georgia, Alabama. You know, all of the areas that I frequent. I'm representing us. So go ahead and like my video. Share it on your Facebook timeline. And let's get the word out. Cedric Credit Champion, Credit Rich Empire. Thank you for tuning in. Till next time.